Hey there, I'm Steve, and welcome to Jamson Entertainment. And welcome to the conversation. Just before we get started, there are many ways you can help. You can like and subscribe so you never miss a conversation. But most importantly, please share this video. Get the word out there to the community. We can talk about all the things that we love. I recently just saw Amsterdam. It stars a huge cast of characters. Christian Bale, Margot Robbie, John David Washington, Anya Taylor-Joy, Chris Rock, Michael Shannon, Mike Myers. Taylor Swift's in this. It's very briefly, and I, I didn't even recognize her. Zoe Saldana. Donna, Rami Malek, and Robert De Niro. When I first saw the trailer for this, I really thought it was going to be three con artists, Christian Bale, Margot Robbie, and John David Washington. Now, it's been quite a while since I've seen the trailer, and I'm just misremembering what I saw. They're not con artists at all. John David Washington plays Harold, who is a lawyer. Christian Bale plays Bert. Margot Robbie plays Valerie. These three meet during the First World War. Bert and Harold are soldiers. Bert is a doctor and he's assigned to an all-black regiment. Something I forgot to preference with because the movie preferences with this. A lot of the events that happened in this movie actually happened. That's what it says before the movie starts. I would imagine that this trio friendship probably didn't happen. They're probably made up characters but I mean obviously there was a first world war. There were segregated soldiers back then. One thing I didn't know and it'd be interesting to look up, it's probably true, because unfortunately that's how things were back then. This regiment of soldiers, because they weren't white, weren't allowed to wear the American uniform. They were forced to wear French uniform because the other troops felt they were disgracing the uniform, where in fact they were disgracing themselves and the uniform and the country by having those views. They should have allowed them to wear the exact same uniform and march next to them proudly. Other things Things I'm sure happened, well, one thing I know for sure happened because there's a speech in this movie and at the end credits they show the actual speech right next to it. So there is truth in this movie. I think the murder mystery in this may be made up, I'm not sure. Like I said, it will be interesting to look up the history of this story and see what actually happened. But the three of them meet up over in Amsterdam. Harold and Bert are injured in battle and Valerie is a nurse that takes shrapnel out of them and helps them heal. Valerie has a crush on Harold and Harold and Bert are best friends and there's just this pact that they make that the three of them will be inseparable even though Bert would be a third wheel and they show their friendship in Amsterdam. Years later back home, I believe this is set in New York, Bert has his medical practice where he helps veterans and Harold has his law firm where he helps veterans. They get roped up in the mysterious death of General Meekins. But it's way more complicated than just a murder mystery. And I'm going to stop there with the plot because the movie is enjoyable. The three friends have wonderful chemistry together. I love watching them on screen every second. The one problem I have with this movie is this could just be me as well. It starts off with a certain kind of energy. It's not like full throttle, but it's pretty high energy. And then it just kind of slows down and it stays that way for the rest of the movie. I don't know why it lost that energy. It could have been in the edit or it could just been designed that way. When I first saw the trailer I was really excited for this movie. Like I said it could be me but that's how I saw it. The beginning of this movie is like I can't wait to get this on 4k and now I'm like maybe catch it on streaming. Those are my thoughts on the movie Amsterdam. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you like what you saw, like it. If you think other people like it, share it. If you really liked it, hit the subscribe button. Thank you for watching and live your imagination.